Okay, so I needed to make another video. I went to my first meetup with a group called Darker Than Brown, and they are a natural hair um, meetup group in, based in New York City for um, women, mainly African American, black women, women of African descent, um, in the New York City metropolitan area. So I went to my first meetup on St. Patrick's Day. And the meetup was sponsored by, uh, what is the name of this company? Soft and Free. And it was actually really fun. I thought it was going to be kind of awkward. And at first it was kind of awkward because I'm like one of those awkward black girls. I don't know if you guys watched that series, um, the Miss Reggie's awkward black girl, but it's like, oh my god, I don't know anybody. It's like high school. What should I do? Should I say hi? Maybe I'm just sit here. Um, <laughs> So that was going on in my head, and then, like, the outward me was actually, like, talking and making friends. Um, and I also potentially got a client. Someone was like, oh, I really like your braids. And I was like, oh, okay, I did it myself. And she was like, oh, my God, I braid my hair. So um, I might be braiding someone's hair this week. We'll see what happens. But anyways, the first 40 women that showed up to the event got some free products from Soft and Free. And I wanted to make sure I was one of those 40 women with their last. So let's look at the products that I received in my bag. So the first thing I got was the Nothing But Curl Wake Up Spray. Okay. So, great thing about this product, it has no petroleum, no mineral oil, no sulfates, no parabens, no colorants, no phthalate. And it says, uh, revive and add shine to curls, waves, coils. Okay, so get your curls to rise and shine anytime. Soft and free, grow healthy, curl wake up spray, refreshes and revives tired hair in minutes. Made from nothing but honest ingredients and virtually weightless, natural shine sisters. It brings your style beautifully back to life. Detangles conditions at shine, invigorates your curls. So spray, on di spray directly onto your hair and then style as usual. And I'm not going to read you the ingredient list, but the first thing is water. Then there's glycerin. Um, then there's some chemicals, uh, including a mode and methicone. So I think that's a type of silicone, because it ends with cone. Um, and then there are a bunch of oils, some vitamin, sulfur, SCA polyquat, and then I see some other chemicals. Uh, okay, so I might look up what these chemicals are to see if they are naturally derived um, or if they're just synthetic. Um, but I did try this product on my mom's hair today. Uh, my hair is braided, as I said, so I'll try it on me when I take out my braids in, like, two or three weeks. Um, and my mom's hair responded really well to this product. My mom is, like, 4B, 4C, and her hair just, like, shrinks up really, really badly. Um, like, you can't tell that her hair is, like, you know on her neck. It just looks like this tiny little afro. But anyways, I used this on her hair, and... It seemed to respond really well. It felt really moisturized and soft, and it was very easy for me to comb because um, I was fixing it for her. So, so far, I think this will be a good product. And then I got two packages of the Nothing But Curly Pudding. Okay. So same thing as the spray, there are no metrolatum, mineral oil, sulfate, parabens, colorants, or phthalates. And this says it will define and enhance curls and coils. Like things wild, or is tame more your style? Get nothing but style and versatility and control with soft and free, grow healthy, curly pudding. Made with honest ingredients, the luxurious style and conditioner lets you do everything from create washing wear looks, like washing their looks, to two strand twists, soften tight curls and long Uh So they first they want you to lightly dampen the hair with the curl wake up spray, and then rub the curly pudding between the palms of your hands and apply style with fingers or comb. And I guess since this is a sample size, it does not have the ingredient list, but I can go online and look to see what is in this product. 
So I haven't tried that at all yet. I have no opinion of it yet. Um, and then the last product, ooh, the last product that I got was nothing but curl sealer. Also, on the side note, can I just say, you know, two normal size products for free, like, already this company kind of has me on their side. If you're willing to give away 40 free full size um, products and also give away your whole line to three women, yeah, so three women at the event won the whole line from this company, so that was like eight or nine different products that they got for free. Like, that is awesome. Just saying. Um, also, the guy who started this line, his name is William. He is, like, really friendly. Um, and he uses all of his products. I didn't expect uh, it to be a man. I was kind of surprised. I was like, oh, could it be a lady? And it was a man. And he was like, yeah, I washed my hair with my shampoo. And I was like, oh, okay. Um, yeah, I just like when people use their own products. So, yeah, back to the curl sealer. Um, so it says it seals in moisture and shine. Uh, and it has none of the bad things that the other products had. So set your hair free from frizz, dullness, and other foolishness with Soft and Free Grow, Grow Healthy's Curl Sealer. Made from nothing but honest ingredients and natural shine and tempers, it instantly adds and seals in moisture, leaving you with a head full of oh-so-gorgeous, radiantly shiny curls. Quickly seals in moisture, adds shine and smooth curls, smooth frizz, gives long-lasting curl definition. So apply the damp or dry hair, use fingers or comb to style. And then in the ingredient list, I see something that says paraffin. Um, and I wonder what that is made from. Um, the other chemicals, soybean oil, uh, blah, 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 fragrance, chemicals, yeah. So I don't actually see anything on here other than the soybean oil that I can pronounce. Um, and I recognize paraffin, and I think it might be related to mineral oil, but I'm not sure. So I'm also going to look up what is in this product exactly, if it's synthetic or naturally derived. Um, but I'm not really like a organic Nazi when it comes to hair products, like a lot of hair products that I've used, you know, growing up had chemicals in it. And it didn't do anything bad to my hair. It was that I didn't know how to take care of my hair properly. So just because there are chemicals in this product doesn't say that there's anything bad about the product itself. But I understand if people want to use products that are naturally um, made and all organic, etc. Um, but anyways, I tried this on my mom's hair as well. I used it after I sprayed the Revive Spray. And it made her hair super soft. And it looked like locking the moisture in her was very shiny afterwards. Um, so, at least for her hair, it works really well. So I can't wait to try it on my own hair. I will be trying all of these products in a few weeks. I'm really excited. Um, so anyway, let me just show you what exactly I did with my hair. So I, my brother's girlfriend braided my hair back in January, and I didn't really like it. So I took it out, and I rebraided my hair. And I was like, oh, I know how to braid my hair. <laughs> so then I took those out, and I had my hair like natural for a while. And I was like, I want to braid my hair again. So I did these, and they're like really big and short. The other ones were like, super, super tiny and like down to my waist. Um, I just wanted something that I could do really quickly. So I finished these in about five hours. Yeah, it took me five hours to do these big box braids. Uh, I took the style from one of the girls on YouTube that I watched. I forget her name. But it actually came out pretty decent. I'm very happy. My part is not perfectly straight and it's slightly off center, like over there instead of, instead of over here. But it's okay. I've been tying it up because when I first did it, so it looks kind of like a lion right now, but when I first did it, it was just like, so I put it, I tied it with the scarf to kind of make it lie down. Also, the ones in the front keep falling into my face. But the thing is, so I have like the braid down, it's like the ends, 
that I haven't gotten down. If you guys don't really care about this stuff, you can press, you can stop the video now. But yeah, I need to figure out how to get the end to be like perfectly matched. Like this one, for example, how it's like super short, even though it's the same like length of hair as the others. I don't know if I just like did something wrong. Um, but it looks better than it looked when I first did it. I've been cutting and stuff. But yeah, so I might be bringing some lunch here on Wednesday, and if I do, I will have an extra $25. <laughs> um, I'm excited. Okay, I'm going to leave you guys, but I'll be back in a minute or so to make one more video.